Hey everybody, welcome back. Today I want to do another shave, uh, <laughs> shave video slash honing. So I'm gonna finish this one razor with this stone that you guys seen in a previous video, and uh, they're calling it crystal stone. Very interesting stone. Already successfully have used it as a post finisher. And now I want to use it as a finisher after my AK Naniwa Super Cell. All right. So right after that, I'm gonna strop it, shave as soon as I can, and I'm gonna be using boom WSP sandalwood with the new formula, Formula T. We're gonna talk about that um, and how I like this soap and why I like that soap. So if you're interested in just the review or my thoughts on the soap, uh, please skip to, I don't know the minute yet, but I'm gonna post it down below once we get there. Um, so right now, I'm just gonna do a couple passes on this uh, AK, just so you see that I am at that spot right now. Uh, these are very light passes. I already, as you can see, that the stone is somewhat dirty. I already honed it up to here. Are using uh, 1K Tresera, uh, 3K Superstone, and uh, now the AK. So that's where we at. So right now, I'm happy with that. It should be good. And uh, I'm gonna use that uh, stone, which I consider more like an oil stone. It's very interesting. Uh, if you haven't seen my other video, those red spots, <laughs> that's me with Sharpie, to show myself where uh, the low spots are. This was an incredibly hard stone to lap and uh i got impatient so so i marked it and that's where we at right now all right so i haven't used it as a finisher let's see how it goes i am confident that it will shave just fine and if you haven't seen my other video hear that it's crazy can't hear anything so this stone I have no idea where it comes from I think it's from Colorado or something like that uh, Gabriel and I forgot your last name Gabriel but I'll post his uh, Facebook page or as a matter of fact just go to my other video it has it linked his uh, Etsy page and his Facebook page is linked in there in the other video of this stone it's very similar to a translucent or a surgical black Arkansas. Uh, except this one is more silent in my perception. I, can, I can't hear anything and I'm honing with it. I know I'm talking, but it's a slight wisp, but not enough. Uh, to read it. Very, very interesting stone. It reminds me of a river stone. Like the river stones back home in Puerto Rico. Uh, you growing up as a kid, it's quite, kind of reminds me of. I have no idea where he got it from, but he queries them himself. I guess query will be a good word. Uh, he grabs the stones and chops in pieces and um, sends them your way. This is, if you haven't seen my other one where I explained, um, oof, I almost screwed the edge there. This is a raw uh, or more, um, uh, a raw sample. And I wanted to lap it, which I kind of regret. This is super hard and it was super hard to lap, but Whatever, uh, 
when he sends them to you, it will be nice and squared and uh, lapped and dressed and all that. He sends a little uh, nagura of it or a little chunk of the same stone. Uh, and I don't think it's to raise a slurry. It's more to dress the stone with the little stone after you lap it. Um, what I gather is that it seems to act a lot like uh, Arkansas where they kind of burnish themselves, burnish themselves uh, after use and it seems to be that way with this one. I have holes, about five racers, uh, different methods. Uh, so this is the first one I do after the AK Superstone. So. Yes, I am honing again one of these GDs, infamous gold dollars, right? I feel some resistance now. Yes, that's kind of interesting. That's cool. All right. So I think, I think that should be be good. Let's see. Hope this video doesn't extend too far. My trusty 40K or 40X loop. What I'm looking at right now is the scratch pattern. And it seems to be on the spot. So let's see. Wish me luck. So let's drop it. Hmm. Well, wish me luck, guys. All right, let's bring you up. How's it going? <laughs> so, let's get my face wet. Put this down on the floor. Out of the way. All right, sorry about that. So, what do we got? Boom. Well, WSP sandalwood. So this soap is very, very interesting because I had never smelled a more true sandalwood than this. And that's how they advertise it. They advertise it as just sandalwood. It has no floral no vanilla or anything like that is it's just pure sandalwood there's no sweetness to it just woody sandalwood and it loads like amazing uh, if i like something a lot about this soap if i can say where it shines the most in my eyes because i like sweet soaps is the the lather the ladder is insane. We have a lot of water with fuel water, and it's just insane. The slickness on it, I got like peaks in my face. I'm using Badger. Royal London 
re knot it. I can probably add a little bit more water. Let's see. Let's play. Oh, yeah. Ah, oh, it smells really good. It's really pleasant. Um, I'm more of a sweet soap type of person, but I really enjoyed this one. I really do. Mm. Amazing. Super slick. Excellent lather. This soap is amazing. If you're looking for something that's pure sandal and nothing else, that's it. So the other day, I was told that I have very interesting angles on how I, how I shave. Two very specific videos on why I do the things I do. You can check them out. Hmm. So let's rinse off and do a second pass. The scent on this is say medium. Not too strong. But it's there. It's, it's nice. I almost forgot about the blade. The razor is performing well. I think I could have keep, could have uh, stay on it a little bit longer. Uh, maybe drop it, give it some final light touches. But overall, feels really good. Very comparable to an Arkansas Edge, in my opinion. Oh, what am I doing? Oh, second pass.
little bit more. Let's rinse it off and uh, go for my aftershave. All right. So I don't have the aftershave that matches that, but I have a nice sandalwood. little travel guy so if you haven't tried AOS art of shaving sandalwood is amazing but uh, it's nothing like this sandalwood this one is scented uh, different yeah sandalwood but it has a sweet scent to it really really nice uh, more like a I don't know cologne I guess but I want to call it artificial scent, more like an artificial scent, probably. Uh, it's really, really nice. Leaves your face really, really soft. So there you guys have it. Uh, so what do we do today? So we did some honing on this stone. It's called Crystal Hone. Um, get with Gabriel. Link is going to be in my other video of this stone. Uh, oh, yes, the soap, soap WSP, uh, sandalwood, I heard their tobacco is really, really nice too, so check them out, they're on Amazon and they have their own website and everything, and we use AOS sandalwood aftershave, so I hope you and guys enjoyed the video, please leave your comments, I always appreciate thumbs up, have a good one.